Hi there, Ted here. Uh, today I'm here with you to answer some interview questions from May Store. Uh, many thanks to Missy Jasmine who gave me a chance to take this interview today. Mm, she support me a lot and give me a lot of uh, necessary advice. So short introduction. Uh, uh, my real name is Sun. I am a student in Hanoi University of Science and Technology. My major is uh, computer engineering. I study about uh, hardware and firmware stuff. But today I don't um, apply to this domain. I apply as a depth of fresher because I had a year experience in uh, this. So that is enough. Don't waste your time anymore. I will jump in two questions. Question one about my remote working abil ability. So imagine that I need to guide others remotely about a new technology. For example, like I need to set up a Docker environment uh, remotely for a new employee. So what will I do? So my solution is. Um, I care about two things. First is uh, the first is, uh, emergency, and the second is how I understand uh, the technology. Uh, because if this is a this is not a emergency one, I will send uh, I will send my friend. I will send uh, he or her a simple guideline or a useful link. So. Uh, they can uh, do it by themselves, um, but I will not let them do it alone. I will set a time limitation for it, and after uh, this uh, duration, I will ask uh, that if they have any questions or if they need uh, any help. So, because uh, this is not an emergency one, so I think this is better to let them do it by themselves that they do it by themselves because um, they can learn something from it but uh, if this is a task that need to be done right away so I think I would uh, choose another way to do this uh, the best solution I think is take a video call using uh, Google Hangout, Zoom, Slack or um, any platform out there to directly guide them and they can ask uh, any question after that but uh, the job needs to be done first uh, so there is a problem is uh, how I understand about the technology because I have uh, experience in the past that I spent the whole day to install a new environment uh, because I, uh, I have not been familiar with this technology before so uh it took a lot of time and it waste it wasted a lot of time so uh i think my lesson from from that time is uh i need to ask if i don't know how to do so uh i uh, if uh, i need to deal with a totally new technology like a magento i am not familiar i am have not been familiar with this yet so um, I, I'm ready, I'm, I'm always uh, ready to uh, ask uh, people who have more experience than me to complete the task first. Uh, uh, with uh, doing like this, it will not uh, affect badly to the job of the whole team. So that is my solution. Mm, question two, uh, review a book. So Mrs. Uh, Jasmine sent me a book. Uh, with the name is Mindset, Growth Mindset. Uh, the uh, the author of the book is um, Dr. Carol. She is an American psychologist, and the book is uh, published. The book the book was published in uh, 2017. Mm, well, you can find this information on the internet, right? So I think if you are not patient to to watch the whole review of my uh, here is your answer should you um, uh, should you read this book uh, yes 
I highly recommend you to read this book because it is not a normal uh, book about psychology. This is not a normal book about uh, self-help. Uh, this this book have a systematic content, and even you are totally new to these topics, or you have experience in uh, reading a psychology book, you still can learn new things from this book. I promise, because um, the book uh, present. Um, two types of mindset, static mindset and development mindset and this is the f I think this is one of the most important fundamentals of a of mindset, right? So you can apply them to any aspect of your life. So I highly recommend you to read this book. Even uh, I don't care who you are but I think it's really helpful. But uh uh, this is uh, here is some uh, advice from me to read this book more uh, easily. Uh, I don't think you should read it from start to the end because, uh, well, I don't think it's necessary. Uh, the book uh, I the book has eight chapters, so chapter one, two, and three is the fundamental things that will uh, let you understand deeply about two type of uh, mindset. Then uh the otherwise chapters will uh, let you know how these type of uh, mindset appear in real life in many aspects of real life like sport like uh work offices like family like love so uh you don't have to read carefully the first three chapters you don't need to uh, follow the rules you can read any chapter behind uh, uh, by your own way right so to be clear I have not uh, finished it yet I just um, uh, read carefully the uh, first three chapters then I jump to uh, sport aspect and uh, work aspect chapter f uh, four and five uh, and uh, I jump right right to uh, chapter eight to to read how to apply them to my life. Uh, I skip the love section, love chapters, because uh, well, I, I I think I can read this later, but uh, uh, right now I can skip this uh, without uh, uh, missing any information because I got fundamental information from the first three chapters. So this is um, my advice to this is my review for this book. I will we keep. I will keep on reading this book so hope you will have fun with uh, this book this is really a good book so my grade is I will let uh, I will set it like 7 grade of 10 this is a um, good book so thank you this is my answer for the first two questions of uh, my store thank for watching